Hi, this is Jaden with CCTV Security Pros. Today, I'm going to teach you how to set up one of our SureVision PTZ cameras with preset patrols and auto tracking. Let's get started. First, I'll show you how to set up a preset patrol. Go to the menu on your NVR. It may ask you to log in if you have not already. Make sure the camera section at the top left is selected and click PTZ. At the top, you can select the channel you wish to edit and you'll see the live view of the current camera below. Presets are the views that you wish for the camera to cycle through. To set up a preset, move your camera with the controls below the image to a position you'd like to save. You can then click the blue edit button at the top right. It will let you name that preset and then it will save it. You can repeat this process as many times as you need until you get all of the views you'd like to cycle through. Patrols are a combination of presets and control how long each preset lasts and the order in which they switch between each other. To create a patrol, we want to add our presets in the form of key points. Click the Add Key Point button. A screen should pop up letting you choose which preset to add. You can also choose how long the camera will stay on that preset with the duration and choose how fast the camera will move with the speed. Do note that each camera has a minimum duration that it will stay on one preset for. Add more key points for each of your presets. If you need to change the order, you can use the move up or move down buttons. Click apply at the bottom when you have the patrol configured to your liking. You can now click the triangular play button on the right. This will start your patrol and will stay active until you either stop it with the square button or move the camera manually. If you'd like the patrol to resume after you move the camera, you can click on Auto Guard. Make sure you enable the Auto Guard by clicking on the checkbox and then you have a few options. The idle state duration is how long the camera needs to be idle or unmoved before it will return to the patrol. For the mode, you can set that to Preset Patrol, and you can select which patrol to use. Most people will only have Preset Patrol 1 set up. Click Apply at the bottom when finished. If done correctly, after the camera is idle for the duration you chose, it will start the patrol over from the first key point onward. Now I'll show you how to set up auto tracking. Click VCA on the left of the menu. You can choose the camera you want to set up at the top. Then, scroll all the way down with your mouse wheel until you see auto tracking. Click the checkbox to enable auto tracking and it will start following automatically when it sees a human or motor vehicle. To configure the camera's behavior, we can click the cog wheel to the right. You will see a few settings here that we can change on the right. Continuously track, if enabled, will have the camera track a human or motor vehicle until the subject leaves the view entirely. If you turn this setting off, the tracking timeout setting will determine how long it tracks the subject before moving back to its original position. If you have auto guard set up already like in the previous section, the camera will restart its preset patrol when the tracking stops. If you do not have auto guard set up, the camera will simply move back to its original position when it stops. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a like and consider subscribing to catch any guides in the future. Thanks for watching.